Hey fellow hold winners, it's Angry Turtle and in this episode of Turtle's Lab we'll be testing how exactly Grenadier perk works. I would like to send my thanks to Kingston. They decided to sponsor three of my videos and you know that I'm normally reluctant to accept sponsor for my video, but this is different story as I'm using Kingston product for years already. They never fail me, then I'm super happy to help them out and advertise Kingston memory. Super fast, reliable and in my opinion, amazing design. Link to the website in description. With what it actually works and if there is anything that it doesn't work maybe, I don't know. We'll see multiple weapons and for the setup for this testing I will be aiming at uh, Mr. Bottle left eye, I mean it's his right eye, My from my side is left eye and then we will see if Mitsu will be taking damage on the side from the bottle and after that when I will put Mitsu just outside of the radius of the explosion I will equip a grenadier perk and we'll see if it helps, I mean if the damage will actually reach. Then that's the idea. Therefore, we, without further ado, let's start testing. And first on the list, it's Hellstorm Missile Launcher. There it is, Mitzi character on the left. Is she far enough? I think she took some damage. Yes, she's taking a little bit damage. Let's move her a little bit farther away. Let me see now. Okay, now she's not taking any damage. As you can see, there is no damage. Then it's outside of the range from the Messiah explosion. Okay, let, let's heal. Okay, full health. Let's equip Grenadier. Grenadier equip. Capi Eye. Bottle Eye. Target shoot. And oh wow. A lot of damage. Then it definitely works with Missile Launcher. Okay, let's carry on. What about more conventional weapons? I mean, Ballistic Explosive, Two-Shot Explosive Gatling Gun. And Two-Shot Explosive Gatling Gun meets is just outside of the blast radius. And we are equipping Grenadier Perk. Will it work? Let's see. Uh, it looks like it doesn't. Maybe a little bit. It I mean, she's taking very small amount of damage when I aim a little bit to the side. Okay, let's unequip it. It's the same. Okay, it's confirmed. Unfortunately, Grenadier Perk doesn't work with explosive effect on ballistic weapons. Okay, what else do we have? What about... Gauss minigun. That's a weapon that's naturally explosive. With will it work on that? And again, the same situation. Mitzi is just outside of the blast radius, and now we are equipping grenadier. Will it make a difference? No. It doesn't look like. Doesn't look like when I shoot more to the side, I did hit Mitzi, but it's probably not a grenadier. Okay, let's try like that. Yeah, she's taking a little bit damage if I do not aim for eye and instead on the side of the bottle. Then no, it doesn't work with Gauss minigun. What about Gauss rifle? Mitzi is just on the edge of the Gauss rifle, if I shoot into the eye, there is nothing. If I shoot the arm, she's taking damage. Then she's just on the edge of the range of this explosion. Let's try again, Grenadier. Shoot eye. Nope. Doesn't work. Doesn't work here either. And I tested as well the Gauss shotgun and no effect 
Although when I was testing it on PTS it was working, therefore maybe and PC are a little bit different in VAT. We'll test that at the end of this episode of Tartus Lab. Now, what about my great and already famous two shot broad cider? Will this work? Okay, now Mitzi is just outside of the range. As you can see, there is no damage. And let's equip Grenadier. Let's see. Oh, that definitely makes a difference. Yes, it 100% works with Broadsider. Broadsider power increase, 300%. Now, what about Auto Grenade Launcher, as by the name, it's firing grenades and Grenadier perk have grenades in name, will it work? As you can see, Grenadier default range is quite good because Mitzi needed to move over there in order to do not take damage when I fire. Then now let's see. Equipping Grenadier perk, grenades in name, grenades on the picture, launching grenades from the grenade launcher. Uh, and no, <laughs> it doesn't work. It doesn't work with grenade launcher, nothing. Nope, does it work? Ha! Huh. Unexpected behavior. But, yep, yeah, it's Bethesda. Unexpected should be expected. Okay, next on the list, Fat Man. That's launching mini nukes. And as you can see, I don't know where it's me. Oh, she needed to move over there in order to avoid blast radius. And we are shooting. Yes, she is outside of the blast radius. You can see full health. Equipping Grenadier. And now, poor, poor Mr. Bottle, look at him. <laughs> so many holes. Oh, it certainly works. It killed me. <laughs> and did damage to Mitzi, I can see on second screen. Yep, certainly works with Fatman. And again, Mitzi is just outside of the range from Tesla Arc. Equipping Grenadier perk. Grenadier perk equipped, the same shot. And it doesn't work. Hmm. Doesn't work, unless no, there is nothing on the way. Interesting. Okay, it doesn't seem to work with Tesla rifle now. I don't know when this change happened. And yeah. That's unexpected again. Do you fix it or is it only in PvP different rules? I think not. It's hard to test on the mobs. You guys let me know if you have a lot of experience with Tesla Rifle. Is Grenadier working when you use Tesla Rifle on mobs or not anymore? I'm awaiting your input here. It doesn't work on this test. Let's see the Gamma Gun. The Gamma Gun. The gun with huge visual explosion, but really small actual radius. As you can see, Mitzi over there is already outside of the range from the Gamma Gun without Grenadier. Then let's add Grenadier. And let's see. It does work on the Gamma Gun, confirmed. I'm doing damage to Mitzi by shooting Gamma Gun. Therefore, yeah, does work on the Gamma Gun. If you need it for PvP, but if you are using it versus mobs, don't use Grenadier with that, it will heal them. <laughs> yeah, you don't want bigger radiation explosion if you are using it versus mobs. And lastly, what do we have to test yet? I think Legacy. I did nothing about Legacy. Napalmer. Here's my explosive Napalmer. Let's see if radius will be boosted with Legacy. Okay, Mitzi is just outside of the range from the explosions. Poor Mr. Bottle. I even needed to move closer because the accuracy on this gun is really not good, but I'm not doing any damage to Mitzi. Now equipping Grenadier. And I'm still not doing any damage. Then yeah, Grenadier doesn't seem to be working with explosive effect on weapons that are not naturally explosive. About grenades, it works. It's hard to test here, but I was testing on mobs and it looked like 
all the grenades are working with Grenadier perk, unless I missed something, but I don't think so. I think all of them are working. If any of the grenades is not working, let me know, but from my testing, they do work. Then now it's time to see about those Gauss weapons in VATS. Does Grenadier work or not? And for the first test, we'll be aiming for the head without Grenadier equipped. Oh, don't detect me. The trick is I need to stay hidden. And let's see. He's taking zero damage. Basically, almost zero damage. An explosion is not working. I need to get rid of this doggo. That was fully charged shot. That was an explosion. Okay, stop hiding. What are you doing, Super Mutant? You need to be out in the open or all the tests will be pointless. Okay, let's try to be sure again. But I think I'm doing like zero to one damage, something like that, and it's fine. Now let's see if I equip Grenadier. Will it change it? Because I'm not charging. That's why I'm doing basically zero damage when explosion is not connecting. Now with Grenadier. Oh, please, Super Mutant, what are you doing? Get out of there. Why you keep going up behind this tree? Okay. Oh, my AP. Ah, come on. Where's my corn soup? Campanity. All right, that's fixed. Come back here. Oh, stupid super mutant. Can't you stand still? Cannot stand next to any object or it will interfere with the testing. Come, back out. Get back out. Oh, I'm doing explosion damage here, but please come on the road. Oh, wow. Damn super mutant. Okay, got him on the road. And I'm doing damage. Okay, Grenadier does work in VATS. Uh, unequipped. There is like close to no damage. Yeah, close to no damage. Equipping. And I have damage from explosion. Then Grenadier does work in VATS with weapons that it doesn't work otherwise. Then Gauss weapons will work in VATS. I'm not sure how the legacy and other explosive weapons, but it's possible that it will work in VATS when it doesn't, at least on PvP. Will it work without VATS the same? Is it PvP with slightly different rules? No. I'm not doing any explosive damage without VATS, okay. VATS rules are different from non-VATS rules. Then, if you are using weapons in VATS, Grenadier most likely beneficial even on the weapons that it doesn't work otherwise. It's hard to test with something like Grenade Launcher, as it already has huge radius, then I don't know if this will help if you have Grenade Launcher, if you add Grenadier on top of that. But definitely, if you have any type of Gauss weapon with really small explosive radius, Grenadier will help in VATS, but it will do nothing outside of VATS. I hope this info drop will be helpful for you. I did this testing for you and for myself as well, because this stuff is, you know, you cannot rely on patch notes. It's supposed to work only with grenades, but it works with whatever it wants and whatever rules it's like to use. Like there is no universal rules. Like VATS have its own rules. No VATS, different rules. Yeah, it's simple. Just no rules. Rules do not apply to Fallout 76. And that being said, thank you a lot for watching. And as always, see you guys in the next one.